but he means to take this championship. He started like that. Can Oliver come back? Yes, he can with a great right hand, but he fair to Guzman. It just bounced off his chin, Glenn. Well, he needed to do something like that, Oliver, because he was just allowing Guzman to throw the shot. But this is a great first round. Guzman letting it all go. And Oliver already wants to hear that bell. He's aching for the bell, quite literally. Legs rocked again. Now you know why they call him Little Tyson. Well, what a good round, and a good round for Guzman. Never really let Oliver have a chance. Well, what a start to the evening that was. From the man from the Dominican Republic. In the shadow of the castle, which dates back to Roman times. Here in the past stage, rock concerts by Queen and Brian Adams and Sting and Simply Red. It's the fighters who are centre stage tonight. And how? Well, it was all Guzman. Oliver got one good right hand in, but Guzman just kept the pressure on him. Some really good shots going in. Narrowed the distance down and some heavy pressure, especially with that right hand, solid punches time and time again. No knockdown, but nearly a 10-8 round. Yep, almost, almost. I think Oliver had a one good right hand, which stung Guzman, but that was it. We are 11 of 17 wins inside two rounds, Guzman, and he might add to that statistic here unless Oliver is very careful. Gold trunks, remember, of the heavy favourite here, Juan Guzman. It looks like Joan Guzman when you look at the name on paper, but it's pronounced Juan. Just as well for him, really. <laughs> yeah, I think he'd be happy with Juan. He looks distinctly useful. He's only 26. People in the trade would have seen the odd video of him, but uh, he will be largely unseen, I would say, to a British boxing audience. Well, he's been allowed to pretty much tee off so far, Guzman. And really, Oliver has to start throwing some shots. He's got one right hand, but he needs a lot more than that to get himself in this fight. Difficult for Oliver, only arrived in this country a couple of days ago, a bit of jet lag, plus he only made the weight limit at the third attempt, which suggests that his preparation was inadequate coming in so late with the Sanchez injury. So it's not easy for him, and it's especially not easy when you're facing a guy like Guzman. Argentina, of course, the country that produced the great middleweight Carlos Monzon. Well, Argentinian fight is normally pretty game and pretty tough. So is Oliver going to get back in this fight? Yeah, remember Oscar Bonavina. He fought Ali. He was uh, teeth tough, wasn't he? Oliver might need to be that tough here if he's going to cope with Guzman. He'll be hoping that the storm subsides a little. Well, just taking his time a bit more in this round, Guzman. Just trying to find the opening, not waste shots. Oliver is having to suck it all up in the first of three World Championship fights we have lined up for you on this special summer's night here in Cardiff. Mixing it up to head and body. Oliver says to the referee, one of those was low. Ref's not interested. Well, there's definitely a low shot going in, but the action's starting to hot up again as Guzman looks to nail him with that right hand. He's taking some heavy shots, but one right hand in particular. Guzman's going for it here. Oliver, how is he staying upright under this attack? He is somehow. Not only that, he's throwing leather back. But the legs looking shaky as he's trying to get his balance. Talk about tough ombre, though. Goodness me. Another huge round for one. Guzman of the Dominican Republic, and I think you have to say that is a 10-8 round. Yeah, I think it is. I mean, you know, there's two in, the, in a row. The first one maybe not, but that one you had to. You know, just to stay in pressure, really had him rocking about late in that round 
really loads up with the right gets a lot of power in that punch let right. me tell you something glenn about this guy um guzman when he won uh, the nabo title against hector avila uh, last year his opponent was unconscious for five minutes and had to be stretched out of the ring well he does look you know that sort of fighter you know just Order constant pressure seven. loading up seven with his one. shots and now it looks out. as if his shots do hurt third round guzman must be wondering how olivar is still in there with him but he is Guzman in the gold trunks keep the punches up he's in danger of getting a point deduction I would say Guzman he's had a couple of warnings about that already and he's got away with uh, well a couple of others I'd say it's the ones above the waistband that Oliver's really worried about well that's that's true so many good ones especially that right hand and he just